Hey folks, uh, AJ here again. We're back at my famous workbench. Today we're highlighting an alternate jet that we're using to replace the old obsolete discontinued jet made by Hydrodynamic. Hydrodynamic was out of business well over 10 years now. Uh, to know if you have a Hydrodynamic jet is you need to look at the wall flange. Okay, take your escutcheon off and I'll show you that in a second. But you're going to need to look at your wall flange and there's a notch pattern down inside of there. And you see there's eight notches down inside the wall flange there. Okay right down inside there so those eight notches tell me that that's a hydrodynamic wall flange okay so hydrodynamic used two different jets an elegant what they called an elegant and an essence okay now they had an o-ring that went in down there these are some extra parts i had laying around um the old polished brass so they just kind of threaded on like that it was a very small eyeball okay as compared to other ones on the market okay so a lot of these tubs, a lot of these older tubs use these jets, okay, and they also had the Elegant, which was the larger flange, okay, which was this guy right here. This one's actually metal. The other one was actually a, a plastic, polished brass plastic. So those guys just thread off, okay. Sometimes because uh, of the metalness too, the corrosion get corrosion on the threads here. Uh, so you might need to get uh, a pair of channel locks to get it off. Uh, what I also like to tell people is to get a uh, the rubber gasket that you use to open up your mayonnaise jar lid with. Okay, lay that over the jet and then get a big pair of Janna locks and then turn it off that way if you're having a hard time threading it off by hand. So the alternate that we have um, is a hybrid of two other manufacturers' jets, okay, which is nice. So we offer these in, uh, let me pull these in the camera a little bit more, uh, white bone or I should say white biscuit and chrome. So they all go on the same way. Now there's not gonna be an O-ring. It's a little bit larger eyeball. There's not gonna be an O-ring, no need for an O-ring. Okay, and it just threads on the same way. So the white one and the biscuit one has a little bit larger flange, which gives it a nice appearance. Okay, now once it's tight, you're gonna have a hard time moving that eyeball around, okay? get it nice and tight so if you want to move the eyeball around you're actually gonna to have to loosen the face up a little bit to give yourself some mobility all right get it in there nice and tight and then you'll be fine okay gives it a nice flush look okay which is good so white is available uh, biscuit is also available and off-white and that's gonna go on the same way okay here's the biscuit uh, and off-white and then we do have chrome. Now the chrome face is a little bit different than the other two. Uh, it's a little bit smaller and it's a shallower hook. Okay, so in full disclosure, if you did go with the chrome, it's not gonna be a full flush. If you look at that on the side, there's a little tiny little bit exposed there. Let me get that in, in there we go. You can see a little bit sharper image. There's a little bit tiny bit exposed, okay? When you do with the chrome, it's not gonna be fully flush against the tub wall like the others two are, all right? What you can do is you can either shave down the threads here on the wall flange just a little bit so it gets so it pulls it in a little bit farther or shave down the eyeball so it doesn't hold it back or bring it up a little bit more. And it's just a hair, if you, wanted, if you wanted to do that, you can do that, all right? But those are our substitute options for the, um, Hydrodynamic jets, the Elegant and the Essence jets that are now obsolete and discontinued. Um, click on the link below this video if you're on the YouTube page. It'll take you right to uh, the purchasing page on the website where you can order these jets. Any questions beyond this video, feel free to give us a call. We are your Whirlpool Tub Parts Authority.